What's the most overlooked opportunity for most B2B organizations to grow right now? You know, is there a nugget of wisdom or, or uh, you know, something that you see consistently, like if they would just do this one thing slightly differently, or they would just do this one thing, um, it, it can make a big difference. There's a big payoff for it. Is there something that comes to mind? Well, the thing that comes to mind is if you are not tracking what your people are doing, you need to start because if, if you're not tracking, you don't know what works and you can't make it better because you don't know what they're doing right now. And um, if you are tracking, then you, and, and in terms of prospecting, the basic numbers that we track are three, there are three numbers, dials, meaning how many times did somebody dial the phone, conversations with decision makers, and then appointments scheduled. So those are the baseline numbers that we track, plus, you know, returned phone calls, emails, all of that. But those, those three are just the baseline to track. If you're tracking those numbers, then you know how your people are doing. If you tweak your process or your scripts, you know, does that make things better or not? Um, and then if you hire someone new and you know what your numbers are, you can plug them into the system and make them successful too. So I would say, because I see that a lot, yeah. um, you know, hire someone, go sell something, don't track anything. Uh, let's cross our fingers and hope they work out. 